My name is Kedeki and I'm keeper number seven. As keeper number seven, I've started a cry club, which is asking people to meet me somewhere in Nambour and talk about crying, talk about tears, and ask them if they want to join my club. And I kept asking myself if what I was doing was enough. I don't know, I guess my output is usually different. So this is more starting really small and letting it ripple out. And once I'd come to terms with that, I realised it was more than enough because it's just the beginning. It's such a beautiful, weird little town. I lost my hat in the wind on the way down today and someone's like, oh, it's nothing to cry about. On the other side of the coin, I've had people who've just met me in a really deep place as well. So that was quite yeah, a Yeah, that's a, a big one. Thing. To be able to talk about it without crying, and here I am, you know, 16 years later, still crying about it. I used to be like, <laughs> yeah, we're crying. We do this. <laughs> And it's interesting because people who I thought would cry didn't. And I had someone come and say, oh, I don't think I'll cry. And they did. <laughs> and I got to photograph them crying and that's going to be on their little membership card. Often when you think you're going to cry or you want to cry, you won't. And when you don't want to cry, you probably will. And I think that's why crying gets such a <laughs> stigma and is so deemed so inconvenient because it comes when you don't want it to. And that's what I love about it, that it sneaks up on you, gets you.